project by the United States Great Commission why Donald Trump is signing other violent groups or something like that. That means that those those people won't make it in the conspiracy theory world. Like seriously, to answer that question, we have a stack. Comes with here, they can see the curve of the trust the mainstream media. So Segura. And there's a whole you okay? other form of game. Yeah. My you need anything? Is here to change the way consumers interact with digital content while increasing the revenue potential of uh-huh. content creators and giving people a mission to content. <laughs> Go in. You know, eating a bunch of Motrin, it burned a hole in my stomach, I had acid reflux, they ended up getting so bad they were actually going to kick me out of the Navy for So you're going through buds with broken legs? The first time I went in, yeah, nobody knew that. <laughs> you yeah, actually, thought your legs were sore? Well, no, I got first. So, I mean... Kind of a long story, but I'll try and give you the cliff notes. Um, so I went to boot camp, and the furthest I'd ever ran was like two miles. And it was straight out of high school because I got thrown in jail. Um, my senior year of high school, I got GED. Um, and See that, kids? You don't need a degree. Yeah. Just learn how to play poker. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we'll get to that. <laughs> so I um, ended up joining the military, go, th- go through boot camp. In A school, I was, you know, it's fuck, I'm going to SEAL training. I got to, you know, I got to start running. So I started running i got an overuse injury turned into a stress fracture uh they basically put me on a medical hold and my detailer said look you can stay on this medical hold till your legs are healed i'm going to send you to a ship for two years and then you can apply or else you can get cleared and go straight to seal training so i was like okay got cleared went to seal training they dropped me the first day i had to request to talk to the captain he, and finally the captain's like okay you know i'll let you i'll let you try because i basically said look just give me a shot i'm already here like let me just train um, what's the worst that can happen? I'm not going to die. I can, you know, break the leg worse. So I said, if I make it through Hell Week, just give me a medical role. He's like, yeah, sure, kid, go ahead. So the guy let me train. Um, that was like my doctor, who was like a Vietnam SEAL. He's like, he was so fucking pissed that the C- CO allowed me to train. So he, he's like, I'll bet you 100 bucks you don't make it through Hell Week. It was 100 bucks or 20 bucks, I forget which. But I bet the guy, and I won the fucking money. Um, and three weeks after, I was just, I, I mean, I could barely walk, you know. So I ended up getting rolled. And then they kicked me out. Um, and so I went to my ship, and the ship was like, uh, the the captain of the ship wanted to take, even though it was supposed to be on crutches. So I was like, this motherfucker. So after after going through, like, the hardest thing and then getting dropped, um, now I'm on a boat, and I'm supposed to be, like, healing up, and this guy wants to take me out at sea. So I go to Okinawa, and I requested uh, to go in to see my wisdom teeth. And then when I was there, I was like, hey, you know, check my legs. They're like, okay, we'll do a nuclear bone scan. So when I was supposed to go in from, a, they said, you know, come back in two hours. So I went for it. And in just like my fucking, not even like my uh, uh, fatigues, it was like a work uniform. It was like a button down shirt. I went for a two hour run, took a shower, came back. And they looked at my legs, and I'm like, your legs are fucking this walk. I'm like, yeah, these motherfuckers, you know? And so they were going to kick me out of the Navy. So I, it, like, that was the thing. I was going to get medically discharged from the Navy. And it took them so long that I actually requested to go back. And I just, I'll never forget, because I went in to talk to the CO of my, it was like a limited duty um, security detail or whatever. And he goes, let me get this straight. He goes, you're about to be medically retired from the military. He goes, for bro- want me to request or approve a request for you to go to SEAL training. He goes, how fucking stupid are you? <laughs> <laughs> and I was just like, I, you know, I didn't really know what to say. I was like, ah, sir, you know, this and that. And he's just like, he's like, get the. F-. And I was like thinking about it. I was like, well, fuck. Like, I, you know, I'm like healed. I've been doing steroids i feel great i've been fucking working out like my, it's been like eight months right like i feel like i could go do this again so i ended up pulling some strings and uh basically i just had to get cleared and then i had to pray that i got sent to buds because if not i'd go to a ship and then i had to ex- it was just like it would be the biggest disaster of all time so that was one of the, my biggest gambles was doing that i had like a f- you know free ride for the